Good day viewers. In today's video, we will be talking about what happens to our body when you sit too much every day. The cost of living an unhealthy life is rather expensive. According to studies, most of us spend about half of our days sitting, which can contribute to a slew of long-term disorders like obesity, high blood pressure, excessive blood sugar, and abnormal cholesterol. This contemporary illness has crept up on us completely unnoticed. The explanation for this is simple. When you sit, you burn fewer calories than when you stand or move. Even if you are skinny, a lack of activity can be harmful to your health. It has an impact on how you burn fat, metabolize sugar, and react to insulin. But, according to experts, what makes it deadly? Is it a source of anxiety? Do the muscles deteriorate? Is it possible that it will make it difficult to sleep? In this video, we will be talking about what happens to your body when you sit too much. 1. It will cut your life short. According to studies, people who spend 6 hours a day on the computer are more productive. A person who spends 20 hours or more sitting in one spot has a 20% increased risk of dying young. Even if you do the necessary amount of activity every day, if you spend the rest of the day sitting in one location for hours, your mortality rate will stay high. Because sitting requires little physical exertion, it burns fewer calories. Obesity and a variety of other cardiac diseases result from this sedentary lifestyle. 2. You'll put on weight. Let's start with the most obvious. A sedentary lifestyle is the direct cause of weight gain. If you spend most of your day sitting and don't go to the gym, you'll gain weight rapidly. People who sit for more extended periods of time than typical acquire fat around the stomach area, which is the most harmful location for fat accumulation, according to studies. Muscle movement induces the production of chemicals that aid in the digestion of sugar and fats. Sitting too much reduces molecule creation, which leads to an increase in waist size. What weight loss strategies do you implement? Let us know what you think in the comments section. 3. You will slow down your brain performance. When the body stays inactive for an extended period of time, the brain slows down. This occurs when the brain's oxygen supply is diminished, resulting in a reduction in the production of important mood-enhancing compounds. Excessive sitting, according to lab research, might impair cognition and reduce cerebral blood flow. Ignoring this causes a rapid loss in brain health and may possibly lead to Alzheimer's disease later in life. 4. Severe back and neck discomfort. Back and neck discomfort is something we've all encountered at some time in our lives. When you have discomfort in your lower back, especially where your spine bends inward at the base, the cause can be traced back to poor posture when sitting for lengthy periods of time. Sitting in a stooped or slouched position for lengthy periods of time can cause back and neck pain. If you have an underlying medical issue, this difficulty will get worse with time. You may reverse this by getting a massage, doing yoga, using ice, or maintaining proper posture. 5. Anxiety or despair will set in. It may come as a surprise, but sitting for too long has been related to anxiety, despair, and even a sense of loneliness. This seemingly innocuous inaction might be the source of worry or sadness. Within two hours of sitting in front of a TV or computer, mental health issues might arise. Sedentary behavior, according to researchers, produces poor sleep, which leads to metabolic disorders and social isolation. Vitamin D deficiency, which is another cause of depression, is caused by staying inside. 6. Your posture will be compromised. We're all guilty of slouching in front of the computer or the television. This temporary sense of comfort might drastically jeopardize your normal posture. Sitting causes the pelvis to move backward, putting pressure on the lumbar discs. To compensate for the uneven weight distribution, the head is forced to tilt forward and the shoulder is forced to bend. 7. Your muscles will weaken. Humans were not designed to sit in one location for lengthy periods of time. This is why standing or doing some movement improves your heart health. The glutes and other leg muscles will deteriorate if you live a sedentary lifestyle. These huge leg muscles, which help you walk, might become weak with time, resulting in falls and unpleasant strain, especially while you're exercising. Your hip muscles will also weaken, resulting in major hip joint difficulties and poor spine health. 8. It will be difficult for you to fall asleep. Sitting in a reclined position all day, along with a lack of physical activity, poses serious health risks. 
one of them is insomnia. It will create sleep disturbances or insomnia, rather than making you feel drowsy throughout the day. Sleep deprivation is, without a doubt, one of the primary causes of obesity. Sleep deprivation is detrimental to the body's ability to heal and maintain itself. Long periods of sitting, on the other hand, might directly interfere with this, making you want to avoid physical activity even more. 9. It can lead to varicose veins. Varicose veins are a disorder characterized by bulging, swelling, or twisted veins that are purple or blue in color. When you spend a lot of time sitting, this stretched vein problem develops. When you sit, your veins have to work more harder to get blood to your heart. Swollen ankles and even blood clots might result as a result of this. Sitting with your legs crossed or bowed aggravates this issue. 10. It's possible that it'll cause joint pain. Knee discomfort is something you will complain about if your employment demands you to sit in one spot for a significant portion of the day. Because of the absence of mobility, the knee tendons stiffen and become uncomfortable. Sitting in the improper position for an extended period of time puts a lot of strain on the kneecap. Even bad workplace furniture or simply keeping your legs bent might lead to major joint issues. Choosing ergonomic workplace furniture that supports your back, hands, and legs is the greatest option for this. 11. Your chances of developing cancer will increase. Some of the most common cancer causes, such as processed meats, smoking, and pollution, may be familiar to you. However, it turns out that sitting is a contributing factor as well. Sitting for long periods of time increases the risk of malignancies such as colorectal, endometrial, and ovarian. Endometrial cancer and obesity have even been linked in studies. Weight increase is associated with a deficit in vitamin D, which can contribute to colon cancer. This does not imply that you should be more active. Rather, it implies that you should sit less. 12. Your metabolism will slow down. You may be working out hard in the gym, but sitting for lengthy periods of time undoes everything. It also significantly reduces the synthesis of an enzyme that aids in the breakdown of fat. This results in calorie storage and, ultimately, weight gain, which is the primary cause of delayed metabolism. The body isn't used to becoming a desk ornament, and as a result, your metabolism slows down. You should get up and move about whenever you get the opportunity. Stretch your legs and take a few deep breaths of fresh air. Now that you're aware of the dangers of staying in one spot for lengthy periods of time. Here are some tips for living an active sitting life. If you have no choice but to sit for lengthy periods of time at your job, try standing and sitting without using your hands a few times. This is a great way to get some exercise without having to leave the house. Make this your rule of thumb. For every hour you sit, take a 5-minute walk to treat yourself and your body. You may set an alarm on your phone to remind you to stretch your arms and legs for a few minutes. If you spend most of your time sitting at home, stretch your hip flexors for 5 minutes each morning and evening. Neck workouts will save your life. It's helpful to your back and neck health to do some basic neck exercises at your workstation for at least 5 minutes. Yoga is an underrated concept with long-term benefits. When it comes to yoga exercises, they should include a lot of stretching and breathing. If you do this every night, you can reduce the harmful effects of sitting for too long. A sedentary lifestyle can lead to a variety of ailments. As we've seen in this video, it plays a role in a variety of chronic disorders, from heart disease to cancer. It's not difficult to stay active. If you want to live a better life, try these short and simple morning workouts. What are some unique methods to keep active while working a regular 9 to 5 job? Please share it with us in the comments below. If you like the video give it a thumbs up. For more secrets and tips, subscribe to the channel. Before you go, here are two more videos you should check out both of them will help you reach your goals. Click to watch them now. See you in our next video.